this should have been a number one hit over here in America. I, I just don't get it. I'm sorry, I don't get it. The music directors of radio stations, of top 40 radio stations over here, I, they don't know a hit when it, when it hits them. Number 27, up from number 32 on my fantasy playlist. Wake up June 23rd, 2001. This this was one roller coaster ride of a record. Thundering beats. Gotta have that beat. Sprightly keyboards. Great singing. Ronan Keaton. Ronan Keaton. Loving each day. Former lead singer of Boy Song. This song went to number two in England. It was a huge hit in Britain. Of course, I'd have it a huge hit on my fantasy playlist later on. I might even put it, officially put it up at number one or two on my fantasy playlist. But again, you know, it's just a fantasy. Now, here's the thing. This is not a fantasy, though. The song was written by two guys. Rick Newell. And I probably, Noel, rather. And I probably mispronounced his last name. He produced, well, he did. Well, he produced "I Get Weak" by Belinda Carlisle, which was a big hit for her in late 1987. He also wrote the song "Heaven Is a Place on Earth," which was well, he co-wrote it. It was a hit record by Belinda Carlisle in the summer of '87. And uh, now, Greg Alexander, he also wrote this song uh, "Loving Each Day." Uh, Greg Alexander, if you paid any attention at all. To pop music in the late 90s, you might remember the song by New Radicals, You Get What You Give, a big hit for them back in late 1998. Well, for all practical purposes, Greg Alexander uh, was the front man. He was New Radicals. And after the New Radicals gig, he went into producing. And he produced this, well, I don't know. Yeah, he did produce this record. He produced this record. He co-wrote it. It was Dynamite, Ronan Keaton. Man, loving each day. This is a fantastic record to wake up to. Sunny, beautiful morning. Cup of cappuccino and, man, just get your day off to a roaring start. Ronan Keaton, loving each day at number 27 on my fantasy playlist way back in the day, 13 years ago, almost June 23rd, 2001.